as we try to engage what should family look like? How do we understand family? And what about all the problems and challenges that we see around family? So I just want to say again, families matter. Hail Jesus, you're my king. Hail Jesus, you're my king. Your life frees me to sing. Whatever you do or say, do it as a representative of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks through him to God the Father. Wives, submit to your husbands, as is fitting for those who belong to the Lord. Husbands, love your wives and never treat them harshly. Children, always obey your parents, for this pleases the Lord. Fathers, do not aggravate your children, or they will become discouraged. Paul is recognizing that if we are to talk about faith, if we are to talk about following God, if we are to talk about how God now interacts with us, and we don't talk about what that means in our everyday life, we are missing the point and the idea of Christ's transformation of our souls. else men had no obligation they got away scot-free they can do whatever they want yet in the Christian community they say yes although we do believe in submission yes we do believe in this organization you know what we don't believe we don't believe that men walk away scot-free we don't believe that there's no obligation for men to do something and we're gonna connect this in such a way where men actually have to do more than what the wise would have to do I want you to hear this this is the only word that connects humanity to have to follow and replicate Christ in such a way that it will make us have to be life-giving. In fact, if you look at the sister text in Ephesians chapter 5, this says that men or husbands are to love their wives as Christ loved the church and was willing to give his life for her. Thus, the relationship that is being set up is one where a husband is so willing to give of himself that a woman would be so willing, willing to submit to his leadership. And the two happening simultaneously allows for this relationship to model that that we've only seen in the person of God, God's self. Oh, how 